Hello, this is Cass Blue, and welcome to More Golden Sun. So, I looked up, more or less, what we had to do for this part, because I totally couldn't remember. And as it turns out, it is something that you would, will almost never miss on your first playthrough of the game, but it's very easy to miss on extended ones. Um... You see, we need to stay at the end. And then, find the right person to talk to. Uh, I think it's one of these guys. Maybe I just need to... No, damn it. Ah! Oh, by the way, if the volume or the sound in general in this video sounds different than in the previous few, that's because I went ahead and... Basically, I'm recording the game audio at a lower volume right now than it was before. The, re the reason being that this way... Well, this way I'm not straining up my voice trying to be able to hear it when I'm talking, essentially. Which was, which I was doing before and was a bit of a problem. Uh, yes I do. But you guys do not. The guest next door is dressed like he comes from Gondawan. I better get ready, the Colossal Tour is about to leave. We're all going all the way to Tolby to see Colosso. I hope we can visit the southern continent too. I think I need to talk to them? Lalivero, where I'm from, is the largest village in Gondawan. Calais is quite large too, but it is a little too noisy around here. I see. Right, I already talked to you earlier. Um, I'm just gonna talk to- I already talked to you guys, so that's everyone down here. So now, I'm pretty sure- oops. Um... Oh, there we go. Yeah, I did. What I had to do was I needed to stay in the inn and maybe talk to those two people downstairs. I'm not sure about that one, though. And then you leave town and then it triggers this. Uh, which, again, is something that you'll probably do but completely by accident if it's, this is your first time playing. But obviously not uh, for me. Anyway. Okay, are we all listening? Let's stop right here. It's the chef, isn't it? Man, he has a frying pan! Why are we stopping at a place like this? Yeah, we have to hurry or we'll be late for Colosso! Late for Colosso? We can't have that! That won't do at all! We paid good money to see Colosso, we can't be late! Everything will be just fine, folks. We're just checking to make sure no one is missing. Well, I guess that's okay. But if anyone is missing, we're the ones who will miss out. Let us forget about them. Let's just get moving along. Oh dear. All right, hurry up and start counting. There's eight. Oh no, we're short one person. Now where could he be? Where indeed? 
What's going on? Why aren't we leaving for Tolby yet? There are a lot of people waiting to see Colosso here. Huh? What's up? What are the guys pa pacing back and forth for? Come on, aren't we leaving yet? I heard there was a landslide on the road to Tolby. We paid good money to take the cruise to see Colosso. We have decided if we're... Wait, no. Who is saying this? Whatever. Right, when we're leaving, they tell us we have to ride a boat? Or, it, wait, what? Is he asking a question? That's a little poorly phrased. I can't stand boats. If I had known, I never would have come. It's just a shame a man like you can't ride on a boat. Oru... Oranos. Oranos? Yeah, Oranos. That's it. We can't wait any longer, folks. Can't wait? What do you mean? We all knew that anyone who was late would be left behind, right? Everyone understood that. Then what? Then what's the problem? We'll miss the boat if we're any longer. Miss the boat? We can't let that happen! We paid a lot of money. We have to arrive before the carnival starts! There's nothing we can do. Let's go! Yeah, let's go. Okay, follow me and stay in line. I wonder who's late. Oh, probably the old man. Hmm, now where did my tour group get to? No, they wouldn't have left without me, would they? They would. Oh no, I'd better get moving. Well, for someone with a cane, that was indeed pretty fast. Anyway, now that we've done this, we can head over here. And by the way, actually, it should be mentioned, we can't get on the boat anymore unless we have a ticket. And once we go on the boat, it'll go. Meaning that the only opportunity we had to freely investigate the boat was what we did earlier. Uh, that said... Thank you very much. Please board the ship and we'll set sail soon. I wonder what could have happened. You mean you still intend to cross this dangerous sea? It would be too big a loss to let me so many passengers get away. Say, Kaja, how are you, the oarsmen doing? They are fearless. There's no problem there. It's just that... What? Uh, if a whole bunch of them appeared while we're crossing the sea, I won't be able to handle them alone. I'm sorry, but you'll have to. I can't let anyone else fight but you, Kaja. Remember, the oarsmen will have their hands full rowing. They cannot fight. You know... You know, if you fatten my wallet a bit, if you catch my meaning, I would be more than happy to help you with any... I am guess I'm going with pirates? No, no, not, not listening. Ah, well. If we set sail now, we'll... 
What? We'll be fine. We have a protective amulet. Amulet? Amulet, you say? You mean that little anchor charm? I hope he didn't buy that in Calais. The little anchor has always protected us from danger. Captain, get a hold of yourself. That's just foolish superstition. Interesting for a sailor to be saying that. It's okay. We'll be fine. Even if we can't find any mercenaries, this little charm will protect us. Now then, let's hurry up! Prepare to set sail! This is great! We'll be setting sail soon! You just said that, dude. You literally just said- Oh, that's no good. What you doing? And I really believe you, too. With an equal amount of truthfulness. Um... He stole the... There was a thing here, wasn't there? Well... Hmm... It seems that he stole the thing. We apologize for any trouble that it, this delay has caused. Please relax and enjoy the trip. We will be setting sail very shortly. Okay, the creep is up there. Oh, at the risk of sounding repetitive, I didn't do anything. I hid the anchor charm. Yeah, you know, there's just nothing to say ab about this. No one would ever look in the crow's nest where the lookout would typically be- You know, he's just a freaking idiot, is what he is. Anyway. We got the charm. Oops. Now, do we give it to this guy? No, we- Place it back on the pedestal, I suppose. Cause yeah, this doesn't do anything. It's it's just a it's just a key item. Uh, wait, what? I'm still carrying these. Damn it! Why did I not sell those? Okay, I'm not really sure what to do with the anchor charm, to be honest. I mean, I know what we'll eventually be giving it to someone, I just apparently don't know who or when. Maybe this guy again? Nope. Wrong button. There's nothing to fear as long as we have our anchor charm. Are we still getting- are you? Why haven't we sailed yet? Damned if I know. Um, I really should probably know. But, you know... You know... No. Part of the fun of this, for me at least, is dicking around trying to figure out... trying to remember how to do things. Uh, if we aren't going to set sail right away, I'm gonna go ashore! Yeah, but we're going to set sail really soon, so please be patient. When is real soon? I am asking how long real soon is going to be. You're wondering when? Well... We're planning to go see Colosso. You know... Our friend Uranos here is scared of ships. Uranos? But he's huge! 
It's not that I'm scared. It's just that I can't stand water. I'd rather be bitten by poisonous spiders than sail across the sea. Hmm. Spiders, eh? And even Uranos is ready to cross the sea right now. Well, if we're going now, then when are we going to set sail? Or not going now, rather. That's... Um... You mean you wouldn't know even if I asked? We're going, Oranos. Going where? Where else? To the captain's quarters, of course. What do you think you're going to do in the captain's quarters? Make him set sail. And what if he refuses? In that case, we'll just have to do our best to persuade him. Right, Oranos? That sounds crazy! Yep. I sort of feel bad for that tour guide. So this is here. That'll, that'll be convenient, maybe. N no, it really won't. Uh, by the way, I'm going to get take a uh, small sidetrack here to show something really quickly. If I remove these, I lose revive. You must be a knight or better to have revive. Um, which, you know, isn't really a huge concern most of the time, but it's something you should be aware of. In any case... Yes, I do! You are trying to launch the ship? We can't set sail in this dangerous sea. Why was that? Or what was that, rather? We don't care about that. We paid our money, and now you have to launch the ship. But the captain decided to set sail just a second ago. So, we're taking off? Yes, preparations are being made right now. Not the right voice. I don't care! Well, maybe we were being a bit rash, riding up here like that. Please, launch the ship, ship when you're ready. Dangerous sea? That's what he said, isn't it? It's dangerous out there. Is that why you wouldn't launch the ship? Yeah, I did. The sea is dangerous now. There are monsters. Monsters, you say? Lately, we've been sighting creatures never before seen in the Karagul. Dangerous ones. Actually, even some even came on board the ship and attacked the crew. That is dangerous. We suspect that our replacement ship might have been attacked. With such dangerous creatures around, you might need warriors. It is certainly dangerous. But the ship is okay. After all, we... If there are monsters, I'll be glad to help out. Oh, really? Hey, Oranos, I thought... We have to make it to Colosso. If we're late, we can't enter. That... That's true, but... Hey, maybe you can give us a hand too, Sean. Almost said seeing there. Um, 
Really? Are you really gonna help out? It is my... M I'm a man of my word. Eh, I don't know what I was saying before. If I said I'll help, I'll help. With you guys helping me to keep the deck safe, the ship should be okay. So, can we set off now? No. Now we need someone to protect the oarsmen. Protect, protect the oarsmen, eh? You guys need some warriors. You have an idea? I saw some warriors in among the passengers below deck. Yo. If they're from Angra, they will. Wait, what? Hmm. If they could help out, we'd be unbeatable! And of course, we still have my lucky anchor! Yeah, I have that act- uh, Oh, the music just cut out. Haha. Uh -huh. Well then. Yep. Haha. Uh -huh. It's gone. What do you mean, oh, that? The anchor's been keeping my ship safe for years! It's just decorative, right? Even if we find some warriors, we won't make it without that anchor! He's pretty superstitious. We're not leaving! But you just said... That was when I thought we still had the anchor! Again, if you'll just listen, I have it right here. Uh... Yep. It's not just decoration, it's a good luck charm. This ship doesn't leave until we find it. What's the problem? We've got some warriors to help us. Maybe we shouldn't have taken it. Maybe! Hey, hey you, what are you doing here? I, I just talked to you like two minutes ago. Pay attention, dude. Yeah, about that. Hey, it's my lucky anchor! Well, look at that! Did you find our charm for us? Uh... Technically... At the top of the mast? Why there of all places? I wonder... I... I don't know what to say! Thank you! Now we can set sail! Boy, that's a relief! Now we can set sail, right? He just said that! It was literally the very last thing that he said, right before you started talking! Hmm, not just yet. Not yet? What's the problem this time? The Karagal Sea is thick with monsters. But you don't... Well, it's just like Sean said, the best we can do is protect the deck. We need someone to protect the oarsmen. Sean, you look like you have someone in mind to help us. Yep. Someone to help? Who? Those warriors, that's who! They may look young. But each of them is a force to be reckoned with. Have I met you before? Like, seriously, have I met him before? I don't think I've met him before, but he's talking like he knows us. Uh, sure. So, you'll help us. 
That means we can finally set sail! Oh good, that means the ship's taking off. There's just one thing left to do. I need some volunteers help with the ro rowing, just in case. What? You're gonna ask the passengers to help row the ship? The ship won't move without oarsmen, so... Don't worry, we'll do that too. But wait a minute, you're supposed to protect the ship! We'll need to ask other passengers. These passengers are part of our tour, your tour, rather, so why don't you go ask them? We need you to help out, even with the crazy stuff. Well then, let's all go to our stations while we wait for the la launch. Almost said launch. Come to think of it, I don't know your name. I don't see why not. I am the Great Isaac! I suppose Isaac is also fine. I'm looking forward to working with you. Well then, Isaac. Well, everybody, let's get this ship to sea! Huzzah! 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 By the way, was there a thing back here? No, I guess not. Okay, so... 27 minutes later... We're just about ready to finally launch the ship. That was pretty heavy on the talking. I'm gonna stop off here. Because 27 minutes in, and I don't want this episode to be 40 minutes long. Uh, so, join me next time when we sail across the inland sea of whatever the hell this thing is called. Until then, this has been Let's Play F- I mean, damn it, dude! Come on! Golden Sun! And have a great day! Bye! <laughs>